because I'm going to be putting together a Valentine's Day charcuterie board. This board is going to have a little bit of sweet and a little bit of savory. We're going to have some strawberries, grapes, brie, salami, cheese and crackers. To start my Valentine's Day charcuterie board, I am starting off with some store-bought brie. I'm going to unwrap it and I'm going to cut off one third. I'm going to make a slice in the top. Um, cutting off one third and then you'll see me use a heart shaped cookie cutter I found this cookie cutter at Fry's or Kroger when I went to get all of the ingredients so it was perfect I was going to try to cut out the heart with just a knife but I was able to find this cookie cutter and it was only two dollars and forty nine cents so in the reserved top piece you're going to cut out the heart and then you're going to take your favorite preserves. You can use raspberry, cherry, fig, um, but I am actually going to be using strawberry preserves for this recipe. So you are going to take a couple tablespoons and put it on the other half of the brie and then place the cutout part with the heart on top. And then you can serve the brie cold like this with um, crackers. I used crackers and bagel chips, but I will say before serving it, which I did not include in this video, I actually warmed it up in the oven for a few minutes. Um, I like the brie nice and ooey gooey, so um, I did warm it up in the oven for a few minutes before serving. take some of this white cheddar cheese and using the same heart cookie cutter I am just going to make some slices of cheese heart shaped I thought this was super cute <music> to make a salami rose this is the first time that I've ever made this and I thought it was going to be a lot more difficult because it looks so pretty so you just need a small like wine glass like a rimmed glass and a package of salami and just start layering it in a circle as you see that I'm doing here and you're going to halfway overlap each salami piece as you go along and then once this process is done, all you have to do is flip the cup over and slightly pull the cup away from the salami piece. And there you have it, a really pretty salami rose. <laughs>
I did want to include some chocolate dipped strawberries onto this charcuterie board. Um, and I just did the easy way and bought the chocolate, white chocolate and milk chocolate melting cups that you just quickly throw into the microwave. And then I did have some Valentine's Day sprinkles already on hand, which worked out perfect with these chocolate dipped strawberries. so much fun at making this valentine's day charcuterie board let me know what you think in the comments down below here is a nice sweet and savory charcuterie board that would be perfect for a valentine's day date night you can just make smaller portions or even for a galentine's day thank you guys so much for watching today's video don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up Leave me a comment down below and hit the red subscribe button and join our growing YouTube family. See you guys on the next one. Bye.